So I'm thinking about light blue for the bridesmaids' dresses. Pretty. Are you going to go black tie? Absolutely. You've got to marry a man in a tux, otherwise it's not official. Ooh, all the guys in penguin suits. It'll be like prom night all over again, only grown up and on top of the mountain. You know this is against a law to yell out snake within the city limits of Flowery Branch, Georgia? Did you get Mount Precipice confirmed for the wedding? Not yet, but we have our appointment tomorrow. I read that somewhere. You're getting married on Mount Precipice? Why? What could go wrong with that? Honey, you say you'd be open to this. I'm open. Carol has wanted to get married there since she was a little, little girl. Really? How come? Well, my mom used to read me all this Greek mythology. My favorite myth was about Zeus and Hera getting married in the clouds on top of Mount Olympus. So, any opportunity I have. Hey, want anything from the bar? No, thanks. <laughs> Two beers? They say their wedding day is the most special day in a woman's life. Is it really illegal to yell out snake in Flowery Branch, Georgia? Good morning, Mr. Hinckley. Morning, Ed. I hear you've got some revisions for your will? That's true. All the changes will be regarding my hummels. Uh -huh. You remember my hummels, don't you? Yeah, They're those little porcelain things? I changed my mind about who will get them upon my passing. Okay. The Hummels will go to my daughter instead of my son. All of them. Okay. It shouldn't be too difficult. Why did you change your heart? My son is clumsy. If I gave them to him, they'd all end up in the trash bin. Good day. For this, you called an emergency meeting? These days, I found no one will listen to you unless you use the word emergency. Hey, that creepy trail is still parked out front. Still? Hello? Great way to start the day, Vic and geriatrics from your parking lot. Oh. Oh, I'm sorry, I, I was reading. Uh, listen, I own this. Uh, unfortunately, I'm not zoned for camping, but there's a KOA just down the highway. This is bowling. Sometimes pinball Spinoza's ethics. <laughs> I read that in college. Actually, uh, I read the Cliff Notes. But actually, I'm kidding. I couldn't get through those either. Uh, requires a certain amount of solitude to digest. Right, 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 right. So it's just you? Yeah, just me. Well, you, you just drive around by yourself? Pretty much. No plans, no maps? Uh, I may go to Idaho, come back through here, go down to Florida, but... Who knows? Wow. That is so cool. I always wanted to hit the road, you know? I just, you know, like BJ and the Bear. They're driving to town on some American byways, solve someone's problem, dance with the widow, and drive off into the sunset. Wrap it up with the monkey. <laughs> always a TV show. <clears throat> bear was a, a monkey. How soon do you need me out of here? You know what? Forget about that. Stay here as long as you like. My name's Ed. I'm Frank. What is that? It's my wedding book. Your wedding book? Yeah. It has bridal dresses, ideas for the honeymoon. You've been planning this a while? Home ex, senior year. Extra credit, I get an eight. I should hope so. Mm. What do you think? It's nice. Nice? Yeah, you know, nice view, lots of trees. It's awful kind of a hike, though, isn't it? Yes, I like hiking, so I find it quite invigorating. You familiar with Mount Precipice? Um, actually, I haven't been up here in years. Well, as you probably know, it's a volcano. Mm. But don't worry, it's not active. <laughs> During the turn of the century, it was primarily used for bauxite mining. Now, of course, it's a state park. There have been weddings up here in the past. It's not many, though. You might want to bring up some sort of portable flooring if you're planning to dance or whatnot. What about parking? <laughs> That's a $64,000 question. Yeah, unless they're driving Hummers, your guests are going to have to hike up the same way we did. Wasn't that bad? Invigorating. Very much so. What about electricity? <sighs> I suppose you could haul up some gas-powered generators. Like I said, it's been done. You hate it? 
No, I don't hate it. But? But it seems like a lot of unnecessary hassle. Oh, I'm sure he's exaggerating. Why would he be exaggerating? Uh, Look, if you want to do it here, we'll do it here. No, you're right. We'll find somewhere else. Really? You sure? Yeah. Okay. Okay. I know what it is, Mike. I can't get this guy out of my head. What do you think? Well, I'm thrilled you're getting over care all ever more little concern you seem to have fallen in love with the man. You don't get it. Well, of course I get it. Who hasn't, who hasn't wanted to say the hell with everything and ride off into the sunset? This guy's doing his different though, Mike. Very zen. He's very zen. It's like he's traveling, but there is no destination. Or rather, traveling is the destination. It's kind of like watching Green Acres. How so? I don't know. You're the zen master. No, it's Why? just... It, I, Why? I, I don't think I'm a bad person because I prefer engraving to thermography. I didn't say you were a bad person. I, I didn't say that. Engraving. Hard. Good call. Ed. Yeah, maybe you can help us out with this. Okay. Ed, give me, give me the hey, give me the tie break. <clears throat> These are the choices. Oh, I'd go with this one, but then again, I'm a sucker for French American font. You okay? Ah, yeah, great. Never better. Take me with you. What? Take me with you. Where? I don't. Wherever you're going. But uh, I'm leaving in just a couple of days. Ah, that's perfect. More than enough time for a guy like me. What about the bowling? Ah, don't worry about the. I'll, I'll figure all that. Listen, Frank, I'm a, I'm a great travel companion. License plate bingo? Forget it. I'm, I'm a natural. <laughs> Within like five minutes, I've always got Oregon. <laughs> no one knows how I do it. It's crazy. Come on, what do you say? I, I, I sweeten the deal. I sweeten the deal. Okay. Gas money's on me the entire month. Top of the line, highest octane, and they got all on me. I'll even pump. Except in those weird states where, where it's illegal to pump your own, but I'll pump. Okay. Okay. Okay, great. Road trip. <laughs> okay, great. Good call. Good call, Frank. You, you, you won't regret this. So, how was Mount Precipice? Oh, we decided not to have the wedding up there, actually, after all. What? Yeah, you know, I never realized how steep it is and muddy, too. You know, an old person could just tip right over in their folding chair in the middle of the vowels, roll down the mountain, break a hip, huge lawsuit, so not worth it. And your name is... Well, I, I'm sorry, I thought I was talking to Carol Vesey, the girl who's been dreaming of wearing a wedding dress on the apex of Mount Precipice since she was three. Mm -hmm. Six. You know, Miles, it's just impractical. And one, Dennis Martino. Molly, it's not a contest, and Dennis is not like that. Okay. We'll help your people. Okay. I have an announcement. I'm going away for a month on a road trip. Where to? I don't know. You land wherever the road takes me, I guess. Yeah, Shirley. I would recommend at least 12 to 14 viewings of the Madcap College Romp road trip before you depart. Thank you, Shirley. Okay, now. I realize this is all very spur of the moment. I apologize for that, but you're all excellent employees, and I'm totally confident in your ability to run things while I'm gone. Yeah, what's the big deal? I mean, this is just a stupid bowling alley that nobody cares about. There's the attitude I'm looking for. 